welcome to all of you from Old Trafford, Manchester. The teams then, France against Italy. I'm Peter Drury, and joining me here, our expert, Jim Beglin. Hi, Peter. Always good to work with you. I'm really looking forward to this now. The moment for pride and reflection as players and supporters stand for the national anthems. This lineup: Loris, keeps goal, Mamadou Sakho, Rafael Varane, Sanya, Evra, Kabai, Musa Sissoko, Pogba, Lacazette, Griezmann, Benzema, tasked with leading the line. Italy play away from home. Buffon takes the gloves. Danucci, Brunocchia, Chiellini, Marco Verratti, Barolo, De Rossi. Florenzi, Damian, Teller, Immobile, tasked with scoring goals. So, Jim, tell me this, who are you looking for in particular here? Well, that's a, a toughie, but I'll go for big Giorgio Chiellini. He may not go about his business in the, in the most stylish fashion, but he's a, a dogged, committed competitor who won't back down without a fight. He's also a very big threat when it comes to set plays. I must agree, especially in view of his ability to lead and organise the defence. Who's going to make this theirs? And it's Lacazette. Now the pass. And Sissoko! Oh, surely that deserved better. I think there's always that danger that the defence can get exploited in that way. That must have served as a real wake-up call to them. Well, that should set them on their way and get into a nice rhythm. The early signs are very encouraging now. And the ball's come loose and the chase is on. That's offside. Yes, it is. Chiellini. A third of the match, or thereabouts, gone, and we still await the first goal. Marco Verratti. De Rossi. Immobile plays it out to the wing. Florenzi. Pella! Pogba. Pella. Florenzi. Half an hour in now. Sanya. Musa Sissoko. The Lacazette. Pogba. Griezmann. Musa Sissoko. Sanya. Get the ball through. Lacazette, and it's Sissoko, so what now, it's on the end of it, looks like a good ball through, it's a brilliant interception, Teller, Popper, Musa Sissoko, Griezmann, Pogba, and the first half is done, an intriguing half, lacking only in goals, the score nil-nil.
chers spectateurs. Nous vous rappelons de bien surveiller les enfants pendant toute la durée du match. So off we go once more. Well, the first half didn't really produce the goals we'd have liked. Hopefully they've been saved for the, the second. For that to be the case, though, we'll need to see more energy and invention early on. And it's Evra. Benzema has a goal! Damian. De Rossi. Perolo. Nothing to reflect upon in terms of goals here. It is nil-nil. Parolo. Florenzi. Parolo. Teller. Now it's Immobile. Very little to report from an attacking perspective. Jim, it's a cagey old game. Well, I think it's a, a fair reflection of what we've seen so far. Neither side has produced that many efforts at goal simply because respective defences have been strong. Florenzi gets into the right position to intercept. France haven't yet dipped into their subs. Marco Verratti. De Rossi. Damian. Italy getting a lot of touches here, but they're not making much progress. Bellucci. Perolo. 75 minutes played. Griezmann. And it's Pogba. Looks to slip it through. Can he deliver? Immobile. Damian. We need to be better there, it's a wasted chance. Griezmann comes forwards. Now it's Benzema. The referee's awarded a free kick. <laughs> now it's Griezmann. Griezmann. To safety. The mobile. Oops, ball. Who's going to get there? Benzema. Tries lifting it over. Managed to get it away. Benzema tries a through ball. Goes for it. There's the whistle, and it is going to penalties. Well, I think both sides will be a little disappointed they haven't registered here. It just seems to be one of those games they tried hard enough, but a bit of bad luck here and there and a touch of poor finishing, and it's led to this. So we've gone the full distance here, nothing definitive, and we will be back shortly for a penalty shootout. Boy, you can feel the tension. Griezmann will go first. No, it's been saved! Oh, that's a super save from the keeper. Immobile focusing on where he puts it. And he puts it away. Well, he's filled the keeper with that one and sent him the wrong way. Great penalty. France from one behind. I oh, saved it. He's so focused there. Fantastic save. Italy can go two ahead. No, he hasn't scored. That was inches away from being a great spot kick, but he's hit the woodwork. From one behind. Well, he strolled up and struck that with great confidence. That's a superb spot kick. The third man in the queue. Great stop, keepers denied him. 
Oh, the keeper's done brilliantly to keep his eye on the ball and make such a great save. Oh, good take. Keeper committed himself. Oh, the keeper's been completely wrong-footed there. Superb strike. It's in, and the keeper could have done better. He was always looking good there. Nice penalty. Saved! Keeper's done brilliantly. Well, that's great concentration from the keeper and a wonderful save. Loris obliged to stop this to keep them alive. And that has lifted the roof. France beaten on penalties after two inconclusive hours of football. A post-mortem pretty pointless now. It simply hurts. Well, look, I think they showed terrific spirit, but in the end, they just failed to keep their nerve in the shootout. And with that, it's time for me to thank Jim Beglin and to wish you a very good evening.